role of a governing body in an open school. In this unit, you have learnt about the importance of having a school governing body in addition to having school management. To know the right people who should be chosen into a school governing body, you need to understand the roles of such a governing body. In this video, we provide you with a summary of the key roles of a school governing body as given by the UNESCO International Bureau of Education. According to the UNESCO International Bureau of Education, governance refers to organisational structures and processes that are put in place to ensure accountability, transparency and responsiveness. In an open school, it is important to have a school governing body that oversees the running of the school. The governing body sets the strategic vision and direction of the open school to ensure that the school is responsive enough to the needs of society. It formulates high level goals and policies for the open school. It directs and oversees school management to ensure that the open school achieves the desired outcomes and to ensure that the school operates prudently, ethically and legally. It also approves financial statements of the open school institution to ensure prudent management of school funds. Governance creates an enabling open school environment where both access and success are progressively enhanced. The structures that are put in place, the people who are appointed to those structures and their knowledge and experience of education generally and of ODL in particular are major determinants of the success of their role in steering the open school to success. From this video you can see that it is important to have a school governing body in an open school. You can also see that it is important to have the right people in that body. It is one thing to have a school governing body in place and another to have it functional. You must ensure that your school governing body is functional.